Ladies and gentlemen, dear friends and guests, um, I apologize that uh, we are a little bit too late, but now the last uh, uh, guests have uh, arrived and I'll begin immediately. And I'll shorten it a little bit because uh, I uh, unfortunately have to leave uh, punctually at quarter past uh, four or to arrive my airplane. So sorry to shorten it a little bit, but I hope I will bring over the most important points of my, of my um, speech. So, I'll shorten because uh, I will uh, leave away and aside all the reasons uh, why we are together here. You know better than me the economical situation of the Latvia and you know all the many sources and reasons for uh, uh, this actual uh, picture we find. There are general obstacles, we can talk about that, but we always, if we analyze the reasons, find one reason which is one of uh, uh, the very important ones, that's the lack of funds. So we have a framework, that's a Latvian constitution, that's a Latvian uh, legislation, and we don't now propose any things which are totally unrealistic. Our object is to develop some ideas within the framework or within the constitution to alter the framework. We don't propose to realize uh, visions which have no ground uh, to be in future a reality. We don't invent a second time the wheel, but we look for the many sorts of wheels and we look which wheel could be uh, made uh, adaptable uh, to uh, uh, the Latvia praxis, Latvian praxis. So, we now pick international groups investing in productive industry here uh, are not to be seen at the horizon. And if we analyze the different economies, for example in Europe, we know as well that the big players are not those who are uh, the big providers of the uh, production uh, in the member states that are in a lot of member states the small and medium-sized industries. The big players mostly have enough money to invest if they would like to invest. The small and medium-sized industries don't. And I said we don't want to um, invent the wheel a second time. We we'll use it for uh, your structural problems. If we analyze, then uh, we see that the small and medium-sized industries, for example, in, in, in Germany, uh, they uh, contribute to the industrial production about 90%. So if we could achieve to, uh, to, 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 to push forward small and medium-sized industries here, given that the other framework conditions are uh, uh, on, a, on a good way, then we could have a, a similar effect also in Latvia. Not in Germany, not BASF, not Volkswagen, not Siemens, all the precious good worldwide known names are those who have uh, helped to uh, survive in Germany the crisis we had also, but it was a small and medium sized industry, the small and medium sized um, companies, they did not leave people into an unemployment, they made uh, quite another. Uh, way they available, they paid them, and they said, "Well, let's think about the hard times we have ahead of us. You get, for example, seventy percent of your salary. We will reduce your time uh, to work uh, by by a, a relative uh, um, number of hours, and of course, the government paid a part uh, of these losses also to the people. 
and so the small and medium sized industries were also in the situation that when the uh, economy, the worldwide economy, turned to a better way, they had advanced their staff they needed. Now the big players, they dismissed, dismissed people, and now they have to achieve their goals by looking on the labor market, uh, uh, the uh, specialists and uh, the skills they need. In the morning, we talked about South Africa. South Africa has quite other conditions than Germany. South Africa has quite another economy, has other problems to focus on. But they have a very similar plan. They say, if we want to keep out or bring out our people from unemployment rate officially 30%, 40%, in officially 50% or more, then we have to to, to, to make them motivated to work for their own. So also small, 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 small sized uh, uh, jobs, small, small sized uh, uh, industry. But uh, you know, that is at the moment for South Africa also uh, the best way to come to a better uh, future. So if you want to, 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 to enter this uh, way and go this way, then you have to offer to the small and medium-sized industry capital, money to uh, establish their business or to enlarge their business. Which means do we have to do that in the framework? In the framework, as far as I have heard and uh, have been uh, informed, you have such uh, um, measures and such uh, uh, institutions, which are the ministries. The ministries have uh, uh, departments to support uh, industry, they have small and medium sized industry, they have departments where you can get uh, help uh, to solve uh, some, uh, some capital problems and so on. But uh, there is an advantage, uh, that's a decision of the minister to, uh, um, to, 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 to implant his policy direct into his uh, 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 a department, uh, and uh, he can then uh, directly uh, make a policy, economic policy, a, a development policy. And uh, the disadvantage is, of course, that uh, these uh, means are dependent on the budget, which is uh, year for year to be uh, passed by the parliament, and so on and so on. And uh, by the way, you have in this ministry, you have this. Um, um, uh, wing uh, to uh, to give help uh, in another ministry. You have basically a wing which does the same, but with another focus. So you don't have to gather all the skills, and so it is uh, uh, the best idea to concentrate it. Um, you can concentrate that, um, or leave that to others or you can um, uh, concentrate it in an own entity. You can, in the framework which you have, concentrate or leave help to a special group of banks you don't have here. We have in, in Germany, that's the savings and loan banks, uh, Sparkassen. Uh, those banks have in Germany a long tradition Historically, they have been developed since 200 years, and originally it was the idea to get money or to take the money from the poor, simple people uh, to offer them a place where they could store it safe and with a, uh, uh, with a, with a certificate that it will be paid back if they have a need maybe by illness, after illness, maybe um, uh, in time of retirement. Uh, that was not, uh, uh, um, um, I would say, um, a plan which was born due to Christian help or whatever else. It was a very, very practical uh, idea by the municipalities. They said, well, if they don't save their money and give it to us, then later on they will not have money and we have to uh, support them in uh, special Armenhäuser. 
they have to, to live there in the time of their retirement on the cost of the municipality. So the cashier of the municipality took their money and paid it out when there was a need. And in the second step, they said, well, that's cheap money. We should go otherwise to the Rothschilds or so to, 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 to borrow money. But now we have your means to get money for our social, for our regional uh, um, um, purposes to develop the region, to do something, social uh, targets and so on. And so they uh, you knew how to use the money in purpose for the municipality. And that is why the Sparkassen in Germany uh, are organized uh, by law for the municipality. And that is very, very um, important. It is written down in all Sparkassen legislation. It is not the first purpose to make profit of the Sparkassen. Of course they make profit. But they, they don't pay out the profit to the stakeholders, shareholders, to whom any else. But they keep it in the bank and they use it for financing of, let's say, uh, 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 illumination for the streets, uh, for, for, uh, for a development of a hospital, whatever else. So the purpose is to make money, of course, but not to make profit, to give it out to the stakeholders, shareholders, whatever else. It, it, it remains in the bank to finance social purposes. So it was our idea, you have not such a structure here, but one could think, I thought we think about uh, plans we could be re which could be realized. Our idea was, why should not a municipality uh, establish such a bank? And I think there's need to, 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 to develop the, the municip municipal region, to develop um, uh, social, social projects. Uh, and uh, to finance that, to take money from the public. That means on the other side, you have of course to have a banking license and then you of course submit it to all the regulations uh, which have been given by the European uh, uh, community and which are, are in vigor uh, and uh, transferred into national law uh, and uh, which uh, are given you by the um, uh, banking supervision of the national uh, supervisory system. Those are the banks, the, the uh, savings and loan banks. Another thing would be to install uh, another system uh, which is a special sort, I would say, of cooperative uh, or co cooperative um, uh, body that is uh, a company which uh, uh, is composed by a lot of, of uh, uh, um, uh, entrepreneurs and uh, of uh, uh, firms, of, of uh, companies, and they are working like a cooperative. They uh, give you, if you want to have a loan from a bank and uh, you are not able to give them collateral security to the bank, then they will guarantee to the bank that you will pay back uh, the amount you have uh, got from the bank, or if you cannot, that uh, these Bürgschaftsbank guarantee community will pay it in your in your place. Yes, is that clear? Yes. So that, but that is a thing which has to be which has to be addressed to your uh, uh, companies here. That's a, a, a thing they have to organize themselves, which is quite another thing than installing a saving and loans bank, for example, by the uh, municipality of uh, one uh, village here or one uh, uh, town here in the, in the region. So the one is a municipal, municipal solution, the other one is a, a solution which has to be uh, performed and done by the local economy by themselves and the most interesting thing for us is this entity uh, which uh, is uh, more than only a savings bank which is small amounts which is small which is more than this uh, guarantee bank 
it is a so-called special and uh, and effective uh, own entity which is clearly focusing on developing of uh, uh, industry, social projects, and uh, also in education. We have, as I said, we never want to think about a sudden, uh, a, a second uh, reinvention of the wheel. If we look around, you know it, you hear it, you have heard from it by the newspapers. We have the so-called Eastern European Development Bank. Those uh, banks, you have it similar way in national framework, you have it in international framework. They are helping uh, to develop certain purposes. You have it, uh, as I said, uh, said, in the form of the Eastern European Development Bank, formed by the uh, uh, member states, which have contributed to its, uh, uh, to its uh, capital. Latvia is also a shareholder. And uh, you have it by another thing, uh, which is uh, by another institution, which is well known and operating in the meantime, far over the limits, uh, far over the borders, not over the limits, over the borders of Germany, that is the so-called Kreditanstalt für Wiederaufbau, KFW. We have that in Germany with a purpose to give credits uh, uh, to, uh, to municipalities, to support um, uh, entrepreneurs establishing their company, uh, enlarging their company. They are delivering advice. They are uh, taking also part of the capital, if you want it. Uh, I'll later on refer to that uh, because this uh, developing uh, uh, institution kind of be as an own legislation. Uh, and if the legislation is written down, what they, what, uh, what this institution is primarily targeting. Uh, besides that, we have in the provinces, in the Bundesländer of Germany, we have a special uh, um, regional uh, similar institutions, because the one thing what a national uh, focusing institution does is not uh, often the same what a provincial government wants and what uh, is uh, needed, uh, for example, in a, in a region of a country which is not uh, covered by the means of, which are uh, made for the country as a whole. So we have in Germany the KfW, Kreditanstalt für Aufbau, and we have for each province, it is uh, quite, quite uh, uh, popular, uh, so-called uh, regional development institutions. They don't work against, they work very often together. So what we propose is not to say either or, we say the one thing as well as the other. They can cooperate and it will be in the best of the country. Providing that the government has such a plan for a central institution here in uh, uh, Latvia, we would uh, uh, propose to do the same on a regional base for the provinces. So, for example, for the, for the region of, of uh, Riga, to establish such a bank. And what does this bank do? I quote, for example, that what do you find, and you can, you have to adapt it to the special, special needs of uh, Latvia, but uh, maybe very helpful to quote from this uh, legislation we have. The institution has a function of performing promotional tasks, in particular financings pursuant to a state mandate in the following areas. Small and medium-sized enterprises, liberal professions and business startups, risk capital, housing, environmental protection, infrastructure, technical progress and innovations, internationally agreed promotional programs, development cooperation, other promotional areas specified, stated in laws, regulations, and so on, then 
Each promotional task must be specified in a body of rules. Another task, further task, is granting loans and other forms of financing to territorial authorities and special purpose associations under public law and financing measures with purely social goals as well as for the promotion of education. So you see a wide, wide range. You can support financing of uh, uh, hospitals, you can finance the budget for students who are uh, uh, who are not allowed by themselves uh, able to finance the costs of a, of a, a, a degree of the university. Uh, you make a special loan for it. Sorry? Oh, yes. And uh, uh, the KRB, for example, had, has a, had a wide, wide range of uh, activities uh, where they are involved in and where they would uh, uh, give uh, their their expertise and their money, of course. Then, for example, if you want to start up a uh, business, they give you also advice. And the very funny thing is, they make good money. They make good money. The, the last report was that I think in the last uh, um, quarter they made about nearly a, a billion of, of euro money. But they may not pay it out to the Federal Republic, which is one of the shareholders, and to the provinces, which are likewise uh, uh, shareholders in the minority, uh, they, the KfW has to keep this money, to keep this money in their own accounts and not to pay it out. They have to keep it for bad times when the interest rate is uh, starting, starting up, 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 and they should give uh, cheap loans to business or to pay advice or whatever else. Uh, so it is uh, really also a very wealthy non-profit organization, as I would uh, like to stress. Now, the, uh, the um, word has been uh, spoken out, uh, the funds. Where do we get the money from? We know the lack of money, uh, which is uh, uh, the reason for our conference here uh, in the sector of the small and medium uh, sized enterprises is also a lack of money for those who have to provide for the money, the, the, the cafe. You're, you're uh, 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 probably in future being established uh, institution to develop the, uh, the economy, uh, they need money where they will get it from. So, um, the, they could take deposits, but then if they would take deposits, uh, there would be a bank, and you should establish them with their own capital, and you are closely bound to all these regulations of uh, EC ECB law, of national uh, banking supervision law. Now, no deposits. <coughs> deposits is accepting money from the public uh, with a, with a, with a um, commitment to pay it back. Uh, uh, so it, it, it should not be a bank, it should be a special institution. And uh, uh, if you don't take uh, deposits from the public, but you take money on another way, uh, then you are not uh, uh, underlying to those uh, rules of the banking supervision. We have checked that. So for example, what does the KfW do? It uh, issues Schuldverschreibung. Uh, um, um, it is uh, it's issuing debt securities. Who is who buys <coughs> such debt, uh, debt securities? Those debt securities are bought by by companies, by by insurance companies, by whomever else, by the public too. I have also some. Uh, KfW debt securities. They are generally highly accepted in the market. The KfW has a triple A rating. And uh, that shows, of course, that at the beginning we probably will have problems to, to sell these, uh, these debt uh, securities. You can, can um, lower 